<laughs> All right, so tell the folks how you like it. Boy, let me tell you, get your bald head self. <laughs> you didn't have to dog me out like this today. <laughs> Yes, you I really did. did not. I had no, to put you didn't. it in. I had to put it in your life just so no. you know. Baby, it's in my life. Do you hear oh, me? Oh my word. Hey fam. Mm -hmm. It so it it it's good. It just is it's just as good as it looks, fam. As you can see. Oh wow. Look at Best that. Best chicken and noodles I have had since that day. Wow. Okay. I'm not lying to you. You know I don't eat oh, chicken no, and she, noodles like no, that. She don't. Hmm. She, no, she don't. She she's gonna tell me the truth. See, that's what I'm talking about, fam. So stick with your boy. I'm keep pressing it and I did that homemade so here's how I made it fam there's the uh, whole chicken and the drumsticks what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, cut the chicken up and pull some of the skin off most of the chicken okay I'm going to use every piece of the chicken just about except, except for the fatty part and everything there's the uh, vegetables I'm going to use onion celery uh, 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 carrots minced garlic right there there's some water there. There's the pot I'm going to mm -hmm. use. There's the avocado oil. You want to also uh, use celery salt, chicken bouillon, black pepper, and yes, sir, that garlic butter. It's going down. And there's the organic noodles, also from Sprout. Hey, man, y'all, I fell in love with Sprouts. This stuff here, man, is so good and nice and healthy. This is a homemade uh, chicken and noodle soup. And I, I, I know you're going to enjoy it. You saw Risa. So, and you see the, uh, the, um, thumbnail so let's look fam i'm gonna sit you just sit back and watch the process okay and i'll holler at y'all towards the end All right, fam. So what I'm gonna do after I get through cutting all this chicken up, I'm going to um, put some olive avocado oil in the pan. Yep, and I'm gonna put some onions in there, let it heat up real good. And then I'm gonna put the chicken in there just like that. I'm not gonna season the chicken yet. I'm gonna sear it a little bit, let it steam, and um, then I'm going to commence to season the meat. I'm gonna put a bunch of vegetables in there, and uh, you'll see the process how I do it. It's, I'm telling you, fam, it's absolutely delicious. It try it the way, do it the way I did it, and you'll see the results towards the end. Now, halfway through, that's when I'm going to add the eggshells. You're not, you're not going to put the eggshells in there along with the raw chicken until, you know, it's halfway done, all right? And that's uh, about four cups of water that I have set to the side. I'm going to use all of it. And periodically throughout the process, maybe once or two, I think about twice, I added just a little bit of water to keep that soupy, um, um, you know, the soupy look going on. Because I, I de definitely want it to be a soup, okay? You've seen it. And um, you judge the results for yourself, all right?
and bam, there goes my finished look. Mm, 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 you know how you know that look good and hearty. I love y'all to life. G Rich out in your mind. Bye, family. Enjoy it.